Good morning, friends, and welcome back to another whatever food diary vlog situation. Today is the Monday after Thanksgiving um, break. I had four days off, and I pretty much ate whatever I wanted to in those four days. I didn't restrict myself, and I didn't hold myself back either. So the last four or five days, I my body has really hurt. I have been taking ibuprofen, which I will do today. Um, for those of you guys who are new here, welcome. Um, and those of you guys who are returning, thanks for coming back. Um, I had started prior to Thanksgiving, um, like a, not a no carb, but a low carb. I was trying to keep my carbohydrates and my sugar intake as little as possible, no more than 50 grams of carbohydrates and no sugar at all. Um, and it had worked just fine until Thanksgiving. And of course, you know, us humans, we are just weak people. And when we see, and I cook, you know, the bomb.com Thanksgiving day dishes, I just cannot not partake in that. So I ate whatever I wanted and now my joints and my body hurts really bad. Um, so I am going to get back on track this week. Um, last week on Wednesday I had brought broccoli and cheese to work but I left it there I didn't eat it that day so I'm gonna hopefully that's still in the in there at work today. And then I just brought some like almonds and some like beef jerky to snack on if I needed to plus a lot of water I'm getting back into um, my track it's so nasty outside it looks like it can snow any second all weekend long here in Missouri it was like 60 degrees and today it's like 30 degrees um, that's Missouri weather for you. Anyway, um, I brought some beef jerky and some almonds. If I need a snack, I'm really gonna not try to. I have my coffee down here with my coconut oils in it. And then I just brought lots of water to drink to hydrate to try to flush all this sugar that I've been eating out of my system. Hopefully it works. Um, and we're just going to, uh have a positive attitude today as we go in I'm dropping it um, and hopefully I can make it through the day and flush all this crap out of my body um, anyway I'll check in with you guys soon <laughs> good morning friends uh, I just wanted to share with you guys somebody asked me in my last video if I would share uh, some of the things like that I don't normally share with you guys so I'm taking my water today and I'm taking one of these healthy choice grilled chicken broccoli alfredos um, and these have like only a total of four carbs in them this whole thing does so I'm not a big fan of like the chicken part of it but if you salt and pepper it up it tastes okay and then these are the almonds that I've been eating I get these at the Dollar Tree so stinking good and then I'm gonna have my coffee for breakfast I'm not really a breakfast person um, I try to make myself eat bacon and eggs in the beginning and I just can't do it um, these are the Keurig cups that I'm using have been using for a couple weeks the caramel cream and then this is the caramel silk almond milk creamer um, seems to be working out pretty good for me um, so and I didn't eat my beef jerky from yesterday so I'm gonna go ahead and eat that if I need to today it's really busy at the office y'all um, the doctor was out for five days and so it's just crazy and chaotic between now and the end of the year at the office like I looked at the schedule for the next couple of weeks oh that's how I feel about it um, so chances are I may or may not get time to eat this we'll see um, I may just be eating that anyway guys I will check in with you guys later on good morning sis uh, I my body hurts so bad um, it's like 23 degrees here this morning and we are just now coming off of Thanksgiving break so as you guys know I ate whatever the hell I wanted to eat and now I'm paying the price for it um, 
yeah I really feel like crapola today I don't feel like going into work I got this new weird eyeshadow on today I don't know about it I haven't decided it's by the balm it's one of them foiled things um, we're having a rough time at work as per usual but I'm staying in a positive a positive uh, attitude as I go into work I just ultimately know the outcome um, I didn't really bring anything for lunch today. I woke up this morning and my stomach just kind of doesn't feel good. I did eat like breakfast for dinner last night. I had some eggs and some bacon. I did eat a little bit of hash browns, but I didn't really like the hash browns, so I didn't finish them. I only took a couple bites of them. Um, and I don't believe I ate any carbohydrates other than those hash browns at all so yesterday um, so I brought some leftover like steamed cabbage that I had in the refrigerator that needs to be eaten but I really don't feel awesome I also brought my coffee of course um, it takes my body probably about a week to go back to feeling normal if I eat correctly um, so we're Wednesday hump day um, but you know it is what it is I will try to film what I have for dinner I don't know do you guys see this explosion on my face like I don't know what this is like here's one here's one there's one coming in right here on the side of my nose not cool not cool people not cool anyway I will check in with you guys later I hope everybody has a good day Good morning, friends. It is I. I feel like crap today. Like, I've had a headache since yesterday. I, um, you know, have been trying to go back to low carb this week since it's the week after Thanksgiving. I kind of jacked my whole body up, um, on Thanksgiving. Uh, Thanksgiving break I kind of just ate whatever I wanted and now I really am paying the price for it it's been in the 20s here all week and so my body just really hurts and then yesterday I got a headache at work and I've had the headache all night long I still have it right now I've been taking ibuprofen and nothing seems to be working so I stayed on track last night and ate low carb for dinner I had some cabbage and like a hamburger steak but this morning I'm, I'm getting a soda and I am going to be drinking that bad boy to see if I can't get rid of this headache because medicine ibuprofen is not working um, so I'm gonna just maybe it's the caffeine that is causing my headache I don't know um, so I'm going to try that. I'm going to go into work. As you guys can see, I am barefaced and um, wearing my glasses today. My eyes like hurt so bad. Last night I was filming a, not last night, the night before I guess I filmed a Dollar Tree haul. Was it last night? I can't remember when I filmed it. And my eyes looked so bad because I hadn't taken my contacts out in like four days. And I have all this sinus stuff happening. Anyway. Um, so I decided I would wear my glasses for a few days. So it's Thursday. Uh, it's almost Friday. And I'm pretty excited about that. Anyway, I'm going to go into work. And we will chat with you guys later. Morning, friends. It's Friday. And I am so glad that it's Friday. I am... I just feel like crap and because I feel like crap I've been eating a lot of carbohydrates because I haven't felt like doing any real cooking because I feel like crap um, so this week is was a disaster you know there's no way around that I'm so off track I thought that I could do Thanksgiving get back on track but I just feel bad um, like physically I'm sickly um, and then it's been like 20 degrees for like two weeks here and today it's like 50 going outside Missouri is definitely the place to be 21 day 50 the next day tornado in the next day like that is just the weather here 
Um, I should have just stayed on track through Thanksgiving and I probably wouldn't be feeling like this. But girl, I feel like crap. Um, and mentally I'm exhausted. It's Friday now. So by the time it's Wednesday, you know, after I get done working, like I'm mentally exhausted. Um, and it's probably been since like Monday I've been mentally exhausted because I've been, I feel like crap. Um, so hopefully I can take this weekend and recover myself, get to feeling better and start fresh next week. We will see. Um, this is real life and I wanted to share with you guys that, um, you know, doing what you're supposed to for your health isn't always what you do and that's okay. It's okay to, um, you know, get off track, but it's also okay to get back on track. Don't feel like you can't do that. Um, we definitely can do it. We're going to strive for that next week. We're going to keep a positive, uh, positive attitude and we're going to keep on moving. Um, so yes, if you guys enjoy these videos, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next week, hopefully back on track.